Govinda's Disciple Composed by Rabindranath Tagore Stanza 2 Govinda, the great Sikh teacher, sat on a rock reading scriptures when Raghunath, his disciple, proud of his wealth, came and bowed to him and said, I have brought my poor wealth, unworthy of thy acceptance. Explanation Lines 5-8 to eight. In the midst of this wilderness and the natural beauty, Guru Govinda, the great Sikh teacher, one of the founders of the Sikh religion, was sitting on a rock and reading religious books. One of his disciples, Raghunath, came to him with a gift. Standing in respect in front of Govinda, Raghunath said to him that he had brought a small present for him, hoping that it would be worthy of the great sage's acceptance. Figures of speech Govinda the Great, Sikh teacher, sat on the rock reading scriptures. The rock reading scriptures when Raghunath bowed to him and said, I have brought. All these are examples of alteration, as the same letter has been repeated. Govinda, the great Sikh teacher, sat on the rock reading scriptures, is an example of imagery, as it gives a clear mental picture to the readers. Brought my poor wealth, is an example of oxymoron, as two contradictory words, poor and wealth, are placed together. So that was the second stanza of Govinda's Disciple written by Ravindranath Tagore. Hope this video has been helpful to you all. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe and hit the bell icon. Stay tuned for the next answers. Thank you.